Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Thursday at Rosie's. My name is Eileen and I'll be shipping from New York. Glad you could join us today. And I'll just wait for some people to come in. Meanwhile, I will mount my desk. It's another crappy day in New York. We have one nice day and then uh, the weather turns bad again. So I don't get it. I don't know what's going on. Good morning, Hannah. Good morning to you. I hope everything's good with you. I hope you're having better weather than we are because it sure is dismal and dark here. Not exactly what I need right now because I would love to get my lawn, my lawn mowed. Good morning, Dawn. Countdown to teak stock. Hey guys, um, right above you, I posted a link to a short that Serena did. If you want to go look at it. Good morning, Patty. Patty, your box is already going out today. Um, I got a little behind on my shipping because of my situation and because of working all weekend. And then I had to work two days earlier in the week, but everything's packed and ready to go out the door. Um, but up above, you'll see under Eileen Thomas or Rosie's Auction House, you'll see a link for a short that um, Serena did showing some of the amazing. Good morning, Miss Barb. Is it beautiful in Kentucky? Well, I'm jealous. Um, there's a short of the crystals, uh, some of the crystals that um, that uh, Serena's going to be bringing. Oh, no. Your internet's out? Good morning, Linda. Yeah, it's a great short. Yep. And she has some amazing things. I was like, oh, like so beautiful, like really, really beautiful. So anyway, um, today I brought, um, I've got some clothes. I steamed them all and got them hung up for you. And then uh, I brought some jewelry and I have some glass. And yeah, and so after today's show, I'll invoice for Tuesday and Thursday because um, I don't want you guys to wait too long for your stuff. So I will do that today. Um, if you bought from me on Tuesday, you'll be getting an invoice this afternoon. Um, so we'll get started. Let me just move some of this over so I have a mouse pad to play with. Okay, there we go. And a pen. Yay, I got a pen. I can remind you, Pauline, if I remember. But, you know, right now my brain's sort of in a brain fog. But um, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Okay, let's get started. So I have two of these. Um, it's choice. And I will um, start them for $3. Let's see, $3 choice. I'll remind you. Remind me to remind you. Let's see, SB, $3 um, choice. These are brand new in the box. I thought they were cute. That's why I saved them for you guys. Um, they're from the Hallmark store. I know that can't be cheap. Great for Mother's Day. In the box. Um, this one is across with a little CZ and angel wings. And it says, Faith gives our heart wings. So that's one choice. Good morning, Julianne. Oh my gosh. The stuff she has will blow your socks off. It is unbelievable. I was like, oh, Serena. Okay, so this one says, life is your own song to play in your very own way. And it's a G clef, kind of big. Um, these are a $3 start. And they're in the original box, perfect for Mother's Day. So you get your choice of the cross or the musical note. Okay. 
if anybody likes those, start those for three bucks. I have some more jewelry. Phones in it three, and I'll play the music. And aren't those cute? I thought they were kind of cute. Good morning, everybody. Glad you guys could be here. There we go. I um how about that Olay sale last night? Oh my gosh, good prices, good prices. If I hadn't just bought a bunch of skincare, I would have been I would have been bidding. So these are three dollars for choice. Life is your own song to play in your very own way. Faith gives our hearts wings. And you've got your choice. And it's an 18 to a 20 inch chain. Brand new in the box. Five with Barb. Whoops. Six with Pauline. I don't know how much these cost originally because there's no price on them. But I do know that Hallmark stuff is expensive. So I used to get all my Christmas ornaments there. I probably have, my mom always call it, started, uh, my sister and I, she's, oh, back in the 70s, started us buying, in maybe 80s, um, Hallmark ornaments. So I have, like, all the Star Wars. I can't imagine what those are worth. I've got all the Barbies. I've got all the Corvettes. Um, just stuff I liked. My sister did the wild animals. She's got all the wild animals. I do. One time I did do a Hallmark tree when we were on the Holly tour. I had to put up five Christmas trees at my mother's and one tree was all Hallmark ornaments. It was pretty cool. Okay. So eight with Barb, just waiting on Pauline. I'll write this down. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> 10 with Pauline on the new page as I was saying I will invoice today for Tuesday and Thursday so I can combine shipping for you guys and I don't want to get it mixed up they're beautiful ornaments I don't want to get it mixed up with the um, crystal sale now I'm going to give you a sneak peek Barb is out thank you for what you did do Pauline is at 10, and she is the winner. I'll mark those sold. Okay, and Pauline, you let me know which one you want. If you want the angel wings or the musical note, or if you want them both, let me know. They're brand new in the box. And Barb will be the backup. And that's going to be number, um, what number are we on? She wants the musical note. Okay. That is really cute. We are number, on number 236. I'm going to put um, Hallmark. Barb, would you like the angel wings? Let me know. This one's going to be mean. Put the sticker on the back of the box. Okay. Um, would anybody else like the Angel Wings from Hallmark? Price is $10. Brand new in the box. It's a little cross. Let me know if anybody wants that one. Good morning, Serena. I posted your um, short above, and everybody's going over, I hope, and taking a look at it. Let me see if I can post it again. If you guys want to see a sneak peek of the um, crystal show that we're going to have on Friday night. Here, I'm posting it again for anybody who just came in. Good morning, Joanne. Good morning, Tammy. 
Okay, I have, um, let's see. This was $24. I can do this for 10, buy it now. Um, this is um, Mix It is the company. There's the sticker on the back, $24, and it's earrings and uh, enamel pendant and earrings. And it looks like this. If anyone likes that one, it's brand new in the box, perfect for Mother's Day. It's got a little crystal in the center. If anybody want, wants that one for 10, uh, let me know. Mix it. Good morning, Swifty. So this is $10. Brand new in the box. Price is $24 on the box. And I still have the Hallmark um, cross with the wings. Faith gives our heart wings. If anybody wants either one of those. Dawn, you want the mix it? You want this one? Isn't that cute? Be cute. Oh, I got a shirt this will go perfect with. I'm going to put up a shirt later that this is going to go perfect with. I think Dawn's taking that one. That'll be $237. Mix it. Oh, you want the cross. Okay. Uh, cross. Thank you for verifying. Okay, that is nice. If I didn't already have a cross, I would probably keep that one. Okay, put the number on the back so it doesn't mark up the box. Oh, okay, wait. Okay, Dawn's taken Mix It. Debbie's taken the, the cross. I got that backwards. Deb Swift is taking the cross. That's number 237. Dawn's taking the mix it. That's number 238. 238. Okay. Sell some glass and then we'll um then we will um put up the shirts and stuff. Okay. All right. Dawn's taking mix it. Number 238. Okay, perfect. I got that backwards. I'm going to put that on the back so it doesn't mess up the box in case you want to resell it. Okay. Thank you, ladies. Okay. I have these earrings. These are Lauren Conrad. I don't know if you can see them or not. I bought a pair for myself, and then I'm like, hey, those are really cute. Those are super cute. So let me see how many I have. Um... How many of those did I grab? One, two, three, four, five. Whoops. Five. Five pairs of Lauren Conrad. I think she sold. Good morning, Happy. I think she sold at Kohl's, but I'm not sure. So these were $14. I'm going to sell them for $4. Let me open one. They're brand new. Gold tone. Um, and they have a little, like a little peridot stone. And uh, down the middle, like a little green rhinestone. And they're little leaves. And they're $4. Just say Lauren. They're brand new on the card. Super cute. There's the back price is on there. So those are $4. Aren't they cute? I got a pair on today. Good morning, Miss Kay. Let me focus. There we go. Not too big, not too small, but really cute for summer, kind of tropical. Okay, so those are four dollars. Let me put this back in here. Okay, I can get it back in there. And they're French wire. They're a 
French wire on the back with the little um, stoppers. And I have one, two, three, four. I have five pairs. Okay, let me do, let me do this. Let's do Lauren. And I'm going to call them leaves, leaves because they're, they're kind of like a leaf. Okay, so um, Miss K wants one. Okay. Patty would like a pair. Patty is. Yes. Uh, Debbie wants a pair. Debbie's taking a pair. Okay. It's three. Dawn wants one. Good morning, Renaissance. I'll get your invoice out to you today. Um, Dawn's taking one. I have one left. One pair of um, Lauren Conrad earrings for four dollars. They're the ones I'm wearing. They're super cute. Whoops. This is what they look like. You can see them. So I got one pair left. One, two, three, four. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five. So you got one pair left. Brand new on the card. Fourteen dollars. Can you, oh, you can comment on my channel now? That's awesome. You might want to jump over to Rosie's channel. Okay, so we've got one of those left. I have five of those. Okay. <laughs> We're the only ones on there. That's fun. Yeah, no, I'm going to send it out um, today. I just, it kind of got like back in the pages and I totally missed it. And then I saw you sent me a um, a, a, te a, a direct message. Good morning, Sherry. And so I, because I've been working so much and with dealing with my, um, can't see. Okay, so because they're on my channel, they need to jump over to Rosie's. I think that's what the problem is, that they might be on my channel. Okay. These are two. Um, I can highlight it, Tammy. Hold on. There we go. And then happy. Happy. Okay. So these are cute, too. These are mix it. Um, these... I have one, two, three, I have four of these. These were, the price is $16, so I'll sell these for $4. There's six pairs of studs for spring. They're all really cute, little pearls and crystals, and um, so those are $4. If anybody wants studs, I like to put them up in my, um, up there, you know, if I have more than one hole in my ear, Sherry says. Um, I think it's probably because, um, I think it's probably because maybe, um, I'm not sure why it's um, not broadcasting to my channel. I mean, to, um, our channel, I'm not sure. Okay, studs, those are four dollars. And um, let's see. Okay, he's taking one. Big swift. And then Charlotte would like one. Good morning, Charlotte. If you're just uh, signing on, I'm going to be invoicing for um, Tuesday and. Um, <laughs> that's awesome well someday i'll be able to do my own lives but i don't know when and i'm just happy here so <laughs> i think i have to ha do i have to have so many um so many followers before i can do that but you never know someday maybe 
Um, Patty wants one. Thank you. Okay, and I have one left. I've got one, one mix it studs left, and I've got one, I think, Lauren Conrad left. So I've got one of those left. Got those two. Those can go in that bag. All right, I've got more of these. I don't know what happened to them. Hold on, maybe they're in this bag. No. No. Oh, maybe I left them in the other room. I've got, I thought I had more of these. These are the only silver tone earrings I have. They are, let's see. I'll do these for $3 because I only have two pairs of these. How do I get it open? Hold on. They're like a faux lapis. Actually, they're blue crystals. These are really cute. Look at these blue faceted crystals. These are $3. Oh, yeah, they were $8 new. But they are super cute on the card. And these are silver tone metal. French wires. These probably came from Kohl's, too. So just say blue. And they're $3. I have two pairs. I think I have more, but I'm not sure. I thought I did, but I don't know. I, they're not here. I don't know where they went to. So I have two pairs. If anybody wants a pair of blue for three bucks, they're really cute. They're faceted. Pauline wants blue. Perfect. Okay. Uh, blue, blue, bezel set, bezel set. Pauline's taken one. Three, three, and then Joanne wants one. Okay, Joanne's getting one. And if I have another one, happy, I will. Um, I'll look later. I'll put um, look for happy. Because I thought I had more of those, but I guess not. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. I still have... I still have Express Crosses. I still have the Crosses from Express. Got a whole bunch of those. I think... I don't know if Miss K got hers yet. The stones are glass. Stones are glass. And then they're surrounded by crystals. Even the even the um, bale has crystals on it. They're all there. I'll put it on my to-do list. Yep. And I think we sold these for, we sold them for $10 um, last week. I'll drop them down to eight and I'll give Barb and Miss Miss Kay a credit for eight, for $2. I'll give them a credit. Um, I'll throw something in their box to make up for the difference. You didn't get yours yet. It's in the mail. So these have a $40 tag on them, and they're quite large. They're really pretty. I showed them to my friend last night. She's like, wow, that's nice. These are four inches. So these will be $8, and I will throw something in the box for you and for Barb so that you only pay $8 also. I have several of these. These are so pretty. Those are glass stones. Aren't those pretty? Let me see. Let me put one on. I think maybe I would maybe jack it up a little bit for me. Sometimes on a shirt, I'll wear a long cross, like layers of necklaces. Um, but sometimes I want it up here. So I would put it on like a leather cord or something like that. Okay. And those are going to be $8. Miss Kay and Miss Barb are going to get a um, two dollar credit. I'm going to throw something in your in your box to make up for that, um, so that you pay the same price. Okay, Miss Kay wants another one. Okay, let's see. Uh, not yet. 
Kathy says hello. Swifty wants um, a cross. These are nice. They're $40. They're $40, guys. Brand new in the package. I would just like to hang it somewhere. I don't know. Maybe up with my um, witch's balls or something. Okay. Uh, Pauline's taking one. Okay. And then let's go down. Um, happy saying hi to Tammy, just in case you can't see her. Good morning, Sharon. Sharon's taking a cross. Okay. Okay, Miss K would like another one. Awesome. Okay. Oh, that's so sweet. Thank you, Renaissance. Thank you, thank you. Okay, so Miss K is going to take another one. Okay, and I still have those if you guys are interested. Now I'm going to do a little sneak peek. Um. Musical channels. Yep. Yep. Good morning to Sharon, everybody. I'm going to do a little sneak peek of the um, crystal sale tomorrow because I haven't had time to get my stuff out. And that's why I'm not going to work today because I need to work on you guys and I need to work on the crystal sale. But um, it's going to be fun tomorrow night. And I have these little these little tiny, these are going to be in the sale tomorrow. These little turtles, these little baby turtles, all carved, carved turtles. That's a rose quartz. I'll just put some on my hand so you guys can get a sneak peek of them. Um, all made out of crystals and they're little tiny turtles. So we're going to have those up tomorrow night. Aren't they cute? I hope you guys can make it. And I've got a bunch of those. No, I love them. I'm so excited. Look at this little agate one. Look at this one. I know. They're so cute. So cute. Yep. So I got a bunch of those. Those will be going up. Here they are. They're all sitting in a little pond. If you can see them or not. On the little pond there. I love this color too. Thank you. It's like a purpley, like a purpley pink. But I already chipped one. So I gotta go back and get that fixed. Because this polish never comes off. So all right, so we got that done. Got that done. That done. Okay, later we'll do the clothes. Um, oh, I got some little people here. Where's my little turntable? Okay. Let's see, turntable. Yeah. Whoops. I dropped you. Sorry. I hate when that happens. Let me see if I can adjust this. Yeah. There's got to be a better way. These cameras are just not made for... Um, they are super cute. These cameras are just whack. Okay. All right. Let's put up. Um, what was I going to put up? Oh, I know. I've been wanting to sell these. Um, oh, I forgot. I had some stuff in the, um, in the car I wanted to bring in. Okay. He's missing his little flag. Did you get a card from me? I did not. I haven't checked the mailbox, but I will. Thank you. I have not checked my mailbox in like a week. I'm sure it's overflowing. I just haven't had the strength to walk out there. Okay, so these are, um, but thank you, Pauline, for the card in advance. <laughs> so these came from um, my lady that taught in the, um, in, the, in um, the Philippines, I think she taught, in the 60s. 
and her and the other teachers would travel all around the Orient and would travel all over the world and where they had leave because they were teaching um, at the base. So a lot of my a lot of my stuff that I'm digging out now is stuff from her. But anyway, these are um, adorable. These are little um, children. And they are, they have a nice mark on them. They have a beehive, and they say Denmark. And they're artist signed. And I guess I put a little flag, like a um, cake pick, to put a little American flag in there because they didn't have flags when I got them. Here's the little girl. So cute. So you're going to get choice. Um, not on the, that's going to be a pair. I'm going to start them for $5. Let me just type it in. I have another from same lady. Do $5 choice. SB. Okay. All right. So you have your first pair from Denmark. Not sure the maker's mark, but it does say Denmark. These are kids. Painted and painted pottery. Really nicely done. So there's that pair. And then you can, or you can have this pair. Um, she's got a Japanese um, label on her, on, her um, on the bottom. Sort of like a Western label, but it's not. I don't know, must be a company um, overseas where she bought these. Um, she is a Geisha girl. And look how pretty she is. Look at her face. All hand painted Geisha girl. Um, sort of like a bisque. She's a bisque. Um, and she comes with oh, those guys. Look at the back of their socks. Look, little flowers on their socks. You can see the Holland influence, you know, you can see the, the Denmark, the Holland, the Swedish influence. So she comes with this guy, and this guy is Occupied Japan. Made in Occupied Japan. Yeah, those uh, turtles are so cute. This one is, I gotta move my camera over. Sorry guys, I didn't do this to you guys. Do not fall off of there. Next page, we're getting a new camera. Okay. It's made in Occupied Japan. And he is a little Chinese man. Look at his braid. His braid is so cute. He's got his little hat on. And he's holding a fan, and he is a well done. Also, look at his face. You always got to look at the faces. Good morning, Wanda. You always have to look at the faces and see if they're well done or not. If they're not well done, they were probably cheap, cheapy, and you don't want them. So you got to look at their faces. Same with cameos. You got to look at what the carver did, and and uh, same with cameo jewelry. So the one's in it, five for choice. Let me play the music. Oh, I didn't give you a size. Okay, let's network. The kids are five and a half. And the lady is seven. And her boyfriend is six and a half. Okay. So Sherry's in at eight. Everyone's saying good morning to you, Wanda. Juan says good morning. Pauline says good morning. Tammy says good morning. Sherry's in at eight for choice on the Occupy Japan set. This set or the Denmark um, Row Kids. And they are so stinking cute. They've been on my desk for a while. 
I love stuff like this. I have like cabinets full of stuff. I need to um, start hauling out. <laughs> With PayPal and I hate PayPal and still didn't get it fixed. I'm so sorry. Knock on wood. I don't have any problems with PayPal. The only problem I had with PayPal, no, that was with Square. One time I was at a show and it was like a $3,000 sale for my friends and I ran it through for them and um, um, Square flagged it. And luckily, luckily I had the guy's phone number. I had to call him. He was from Chicago visiting Columbus, Ohio. I had to call him and invoice him before they would release the funds because they thought it was fraud, but it wasn't. So, but I guess they're just looking out for us. There you go. And Sherry's in at 10 for choice. These are super cute. I love her. Look at her face. How pretty she is pretty she's probably i would say probably from the 60s she's got her original label on there going us out sherry's the high bidder thank you oh thank you well i that's awesome thanks guys i try to Try to work hard at that. Okay, so Sherry's in at 10. Let's do sold. Sherry's going to get choice. Mm. Yep, she's got a Japan label. Yep. Yep. You want the... Okay, you want these two. Okay, Sherry's taken the man, the occupied Japan, and the little lady, his girlfriend, okay, the Gisha girl, and then we still have um, the little um, uh, Dawn's the backup if you want the, the, the children with the beehive mark from Denmark. Let's go back to our book, 39. And then it's going to Sherry. I think it was ten. I think. Yep. Sherry for ten. You want the kids? Okay. You take the kids. They are adorable, and I know they're from the sixties because those belong to Carmine. Two point nine. They all did. 39, 40, and 70. Let's get another one. I worked in my booth all afternoon yesterday because the weather was warm and I don't like being out in the cold with my hip the way it is. The 240s going to dawn. Yay! Love those. You got to go. Yep, they are super cute. I'm trying to um, highlight all the comments in case somebody's up my channel and they can't see it. The one's taking the kids. Congratulations. And thank you. Okay. All right. What else do we have? Oh, I've got a. I've got a Fenton shoe. I've got another one in the car, though, so I should probably hold off on that. Let's do... Um, uh, 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 uh. I've got a couple Cruets. Um, maybe I should save them for a night sale, but you know what? They're here now. Uh, this one is, um, this is a Gibson. 1984. This is an early Gibson, 1984. And this one is Carnival Glass. 
the stoppers in perfect shape. So really nice cruet. Oh, I love my cruets. This one is six and a half inches. And I couldn't touch any of them this weekend. They went so high. Um, let's move this up a little bit. There we go. So that one is Carnival Glass. And it's iridized. Well, it's a cobalt blue iridized. Um, 1984. Um, and then this one is one of my favorites. This one is a Gibson also. This one is from 2003. And it's like a green color. I'll put you down there for a minute. So this one has like a little bit of a ribbed ribbed pattern. It's the stopper, no issues. And it's kind of cute orangey for spring. And let's start those. Let's start those at 18. Man, Cruits were just nuts this weekend. The prices, but that's what happens when you get a a whole collection of something. Renaissance says good morning, good Manda. So I'll start these for 18 for choice. Pruitt's. Um, these are vintage um, Gibson. Okay. So this one's more skinny and petite. And this one we said was from 1984. Wow, that's an old one. That is an early one. And then this one is a little chunkier, a wide handle. And it's orange, it's more. It's orange iridized, clear uh, iridized stopper. You see the flash on there? Yes. And a William knows, he watches my auctions, he knows what stuff is for him this weekend. These I had. Um, okay, let's play the music and I'll collect the bids. Okay, there we go. Good morning, William. Okay, 20 with Miss K. Yeah, I love these stoppers too. 25 with Miss K. Oh, I skipped over William. 22 with William. 25 with Miss K. Sherry's lagging a little bit. We'll do this. This. So I will be in Greensboro, um, North Carolina next week. If anybody wants to come see me at the Antique Show, 27 with Liam. If anybody's down in um, Greensboro area, let me know. 30 with Miss K. Good morning, William. Okay, 30 with Miss K. Sherry's out. Thank you for what you did do. And William's out. Okay, perfect. Thank you, William. Okay, 30 with Miss K. I'm going to sell it. I'm going to do all in, all done. Last chance. Check. Yep. We're going to sell it. It's old. In this case, you let me know which one you would like or if you would like them both. Um, price is 30, and that's going to be number. Look at me not writing stuff down. It's. Miss K would like them both. Thank you, Miss K. 
an old one. 1984, so 40 years old. Okay. 242. Very careful with those. I've got to get a black light. I've got to show you. Um, I've got to show you this. Let me let me put these up, and then I'll go get the black light. Thank you, William. I think Miss Kay and I we both love our cruets. Okay. And then, congrats. Okay, I'm gonna put these up and then I'm gonna run and get a black light because you guys are not gonna believe this. Okay. So all right. So this one um actually let's see this glows too. I think I think this one glows. This is a um um red Fenton Rose Bowl. Look at the red on that. It's like the orange and red. I know I had a green one the other day. We sold it. Yep, we sold the green one. There's the red to match. Okay. So you got that one for choice. And then one of my favorite things, I took it out of my tiny cabinet. Um, And I'd be surprised. This fit in my china cabinet forever. Or even knew about Clinton. It looks like it says Clinton on there, but I can't tell. Can anybody read that? Anyway, little tiny Vaseline, Vaseline glass basket. Serena, can you read that? I don't know what that says. Small. So those are going to be choice. I'm going to start those out at 10. Okay. Those are going to be um, choice. I'm going to move over. I know. I know. But, you know, I want to travel and stuff, and my kids aren't going to want this stuff. And I know you guys appreciate it. So, right, so we're going to do 10 on choice, and I'm going to go get a black light because where do you see the glow on that? That might be, I don't know. Have a look.
thing. It doesn't, wait a minute. This is glowing in my china cabinet. Yeah, it does glow. I don't know if you can see it. Because I got the window open. But this one, it. Oh, yeah. So you can't see it real good. Let me turn this slide out. There we go. You can't see it real good, but you see it glows green. Nails glow. But it does, it does glow. I guarantee it because when I when I put the light in the china cabinet, it was like, wow, that thing was glowing big time. And then this one glows too. Yeah, this one glows cadmium. This one's got some nice glow to it. Real pretty. Pretty glow to this one too. I'll play the music. But I've got the window open, so you guys, it's hard for you guys to see it. But they both glow. This sucker glows like crazy, this little one. Okay. All right. Let me play the music. You see it? Oh, good. Okay. Okay. Play the music. I know it's hard because I got that window. Windows right there. I've got the two windows. Okay. All right. Let's go back up. Wings in for 15. I know. But it's not going to fly off. But the oval look like a Fenton stamp. I know. Isn't it unusual? And I, I swear it glows, guys. It's just hard to see in this room because this room is so bright. But it does. When I had that in my china cabinet, it was like, whoa. That thing. This one. This one glows, too. Isn't that the cutest little rose bowl? So tiny. Teeny tiny. I think so. The Renaissance, I can't make it out. Oh, that's not good. I can't make it out. There's the mark. Let's say Fenton. I think so. Little baby basket. Drop my black light. Yes. Okay. Okay, let's see where we're at. Um Liam's in at 15. Give it another minute. I guarantee it to glow. Yeah, it does look like a Fenton mark. Okay, let's see. Okay, so I got Liam at 15 and I'm just waiting to see if anybody else wants to come in or out. I'm happy was in at 10. And this one glows cadmium. This is not the greatest light. Okay, let me do last chance. Just waiting on happy. Killed the comments. There they are. <laughs> okay, let me know happy whether you're in or out. Wait, 
on that. He's out. Okay. So William is the winner. I believe he's the other bidder. You're on a market sold. And William, just let me know if you would like the basket or the rose bowl, or if you want both. Let me know. And we will write that down. And I will also post my um oh I think you I think you said you sent me a um an email. But I'm gonna post my she would like he would like he would like the basket. And I think I have your email. He wants the basket and happy, would you like the rose bowl? Let me know. This is number two forty three. And he's taking a little basket there. Fastening basket, 243. And is the backup. Yep, they're both fluorescing. Yep. That is so cute. I love that. I like that piece. That was in with my, when we did all my Easter bunnies, that was in with the Easter bunnies. We used to keep it in the same cabinet. Okay, Happy is the backup if she wants the Rose Bowl. If not, I'll just keep it and put it with my, okay, you have to email me. You want my email address? Yeah, send me a new email because I missed your other one. So bad. There's my email address. Thank you. Appreciate it. Okay, I'll just wait on Happy and see if she wants the rose bowl. And if not, I'll just stick it in my um in my orange cabinet. <laughs> stick it in my orange cabinet. This is another one. I think that we um did I put this one up before? Did we decide this was um Viking? I can't remember. It's fluoresces also. This one has a nice Sambarina, like a nice fluorescent. I don't know if I put this up before or not. I think maybe I was going to keep it because you can see some of the glow there. I think I was going to keep it because I got the one from Rosie that looks just like it. Um, but this one has some glow to it also. This is cadmium. I think, I don't know if this is Viking. It's got a one, two, three, four, five, six, six petal base. And it's a candle holder. If it's Viking, maybe Serena can tell us. And this one really glows. This one has some really nice amberina, nice color to it. Real pretty. You're into the reds. Super pretty. Okay, so this one we're going to um, start this one at ten. Okay. Ten dollars SB. And I'm not sure if this is Viking or not. It's got it. Like I said, it's got a six petal, six petal base. It even has the original store where it was sold. The glass barn, Blowing Rock, Boone Highway, North Carolina. So you know that's vintage. You know that's vintage. It's got the original, um, is that a little flake there? No, it's just glue. It's got the original sticker where it was um, sold on there at the glass barn. And this one is, I'm just trying to clean off my desk today, I guess, four inches tall, and it is six inches, about six inches wide. Um, yeah, six inches wide. Okay. I'm going to start that one at 10, and Debbie's in at 10. Let me play the music. Yep. 
gonna keep the light down because it seems better for this kind of stuff. It's a six petal. Um, I would say you would probably put a candle in here. Um, you might put a candle in here. Ones in at 12. Super pretty. Not sure if this is Viking. I need to get a Viking though. But look at the glow on that. Really nice. Ones in at 12. Just waiting on Swifty. Thing's heavy too. It's heavy art glass. Debbie's out. Thank you for what you did do. And I'm gonna sell it to Dawn. Okay. Wow, great buy. Okay. Pedal bowl for Dawn 244. I'm jealous. Here's that one. Let's see. Let's do it's eleven oh six. Um, let's see what else I've got a oh I know I still got stuff from the other day got some Glass. Some blood vases. Here's number two. Oh, you're welcome. That's a great piece. Let me know if you want me to stick that in your box or if you want me to mail it to you. Do you have this one? I've got three of these. We'll do twice. There it is. One of them's got a real cute back on it too. So I've got three of these. These are all milk glass. If you're doing like a wedding or something, or you're going to do a party and you want to decorate, there's a chance to get a bunch of those. Or if you just need that one for your collection, um, these are, let's see, uh, 10 inches. This one is 10 inches. And then the little one is 8 inches. And this one has, well, you know, they were different blowers because this one's got a little crimped, little crimped edge on it, on the mouth, it's sort of crimped. I'm going to start these for uh, 10 a piece. Um, let's see, because I just bought these this weekend, so it's going to be 10 SB for choice. And then this one has the cute little, um, cute little mouth on it. That's a two-inch one. And then this one is an eight-inch. This is an inch. There's the top. There's the bottom. So 
So there you go. If you need any of those, let me know. Oops. You see those, okay. We'll start those for 10. Okay, anybody likes those? Let me play the music. Wow, I'm getting a lot of messages this morning. A lot of emails. Okay, so that was either Viking or Smith. Okay. So we're doing $10 choice on the um, milk glass. Bud Vases by Fenton. And I believe these are the older ones that would have had the paper label. Um, none of them have um, stamps on them. Jerry's in at 12. Oh, you have the one with the ruffle top? Yeah, it's almost like it's crimped. Almost got like a crimped top, which I thought was unusual. Office crimp. I like these. I like them all together with some daffodils in them. They're really cute. Sherry's in at 12. Okay, two, three, four. Sweet, non barred. Rickle. Is there anybody else who wants to jump in there for the Fenton Bud Vases? Sure, is it 12? 14 with Barb. Okay, I'll put your bowl in the teak stock box because it's heavy. I did send Pete his cat, though, because that was little. So I'll put your biking, your biking bowl in the um, big stuff. Yes. Okay. Perfect. Thank you for that. Thank you. Sherry's for 15. We're going to be neighbors. We're all going to be neighbors at Teak Sock. That's going to be exciting. Fifteen with Sherry. So I'm hoping to um, be at Blanco next Wednesday. I'm going to be stopping at Blanco at the factory. If anybody wants anything or if you want me to pick up some more of the ornaments, if you guys like the ornaments, let me know. I can maybe grab a few things. Barb's out. Thanks, Barb. Sherry's in for 15. And let's do a sold. So if you missed getting an ornament last time I was there, um, let me know what you guys like. I mean, let me know if you want me to pick up some more ornaments or some more kitty cats or dog paws or stuff like that. Easy to ship. Okay, Sherry, well, tell me, let me know which one you would like. If you want the one with the this is a 10 inch with the crimp top. We've got the 10 inch with the smooth top or the eight inch, the eight inch one, let me know. And that's going to Sherry. And I think I'm gonna mess that up. 
She wants the two tall ones, 245 and 245. Um, Barb Rickle, would you like the shorter eight inch one? Let me know. No glass. Glasses. And those were two times 15. Let me know if, let me know, Barb, if you want the eight inch. Um, if not, um, it'll be up for grabs. Okay, she's gonna pass for grabs, eight inch, no glass, um, Fenton Boz, Bud Boz. Okay. Those are cute. I like this. Okay. okay. If anybody needs that one, let me know. Okay, I've got a pair. I don't even know what I paid for these. Yeah. All right, so these are Dugan, and these are stretch glass, 1920s. These are Dugan candlesticks, and they are blue stretch glass. And they are, wow, 10 inches tall. I need to stick them on. So there's a pair of them, and they're doing them. 1920s. And we're going to get them in the so cool. And we're going to start those for 25. Whoops. Let me get down here. I'm just going by what I paint, guys, and just because I want to be able to bring this stuff. Um, all right. Okay. You can candlesticks for the pair. $25 start. And they are 10 inches tall. There's no image on them. They're in perfect shape. Speaking from I think pretty. So pretty. Dawn 75. Thank you, Dawn. Yes, they're pretty. And you can make money on these. I'm going to play the music. Super pretty stretch glass. Aren't they gorgeous? Wouldn't these be pretty on the table with all your compotes and your and your candy jars and they're super pretty. Thanksgiving dinner, Easter dinner. Oh, I was gonna play the music. Go ahead. Okay, here we go. 27 with William. 29 with Dawn. Still got the Rota sticker on there, William. I just picked them up this weekend. I, I sort of have a serious um, stretch glass problem ever since Jim made me pack up those 400 pieces of stretch glass. The stuff gets embedded in your brain and then you, you, um, um, you can't stop thinking about it. <laughs> you get obsessed with it. I'm trying to cover up that mountain of stuff over there. It's not going to happen. <laughs> 29 with Dawn.
So don't forget about peak stock. Let me bring the color up. Here we go. Marshall, Michigan, vintage market auction and appraisal fair. May 10th, 11th, and 12th. If you can join us, that would be awesome. I have 29 to go on. I'm just waiting on William. Uh, Serena will be there. Dawn will be there. Kathy G will be there. Everybody will be there. We're going to have a good time. Fun, fun. 30, 32 with Liam. 34 with Dawn. Can't see me. No, over here. There we go. There we go. The uh, camera's reversed. <laughs> so yesterday I worked all day in my flea market booth. It was such a mess. Now it's out inside of a garage, so it's really cold out there in the winter. So I don't get a chance to go over there and really do anything. And um, man, was it cold over there. But all winter. But yesterday it was nice. 38 with Dawn, thank you. And I um, went over there and worked on my booth. I need to bring a vacuum over there and vacuum the rugs. But I found some great stuff. I unpacked, like, I have a huge death pile over there, and I unpacked a whole bunch of stuff. So I'll have some uh, neat stuff for you guys next week. If Rosie has me on next week, I'll have some really cool. William's out. Thank you for what you did do. Once at 38, I'm going to sell it. Mark okay. those sold. And those are sold to Dawn for 38. Thank you, Dawn. Thank you, William. 246. Let me know if you want me to stick those in your box or not. Or if you want me to ship them. They're kind of heavy. But it's up to you. It's whatever you want. Those are so pretty. Yes, congratulations. 246. I like those. One's getting those. So stretch. Two. Okay, let's do some shirts, and then we're probably going to, congratulations. Okay, put them in the box. Perfect. Thank you. I will put those in the box. Okay, let's do some shirts, and um, let me turn this off. Okay. And I'll turn the light on. How about that? Show the little turtles again for tomorrow night. Tomorrow night, we got some turtles for Christmas sale. Little baby turtles, all carved. And we just got beautiful stuff. Oh my goodness. Check out her channel. Oops. Little turtles. Those are going to be fun. It's going to go quick. Okay. Let's do some shirts. And then um, I might call it a day. So let me turn the light on. Okay, got my numbers. Okay. Let me see. Laura is texting me. I'm going to move this over. Okay, that's better. Sorry, guys. I'm just moving a little slow. Uh, um, 3x 
it's kind of like the shirt I have on. Like I like to wear these to the gym or just just around the house. So it's sort of like the shirt I have on. It's like a super soft heather gray pullover. It's a three X. These are all five dollars. It's number sixty seven, and it's clean. Uh, it's number sixty seven. These are five dollars. Just say sixty seven. So it's sort of like the one I have on. I think I like to wear leggings, and it's super cute. Like really super soft, no issues, and hoop neck. Five dollars. So you've got that one. I'm gonna do this like I usually do. Just say 67. Okay. And those. No, nope, I'm gonna do those. You know I love my coin. So I've got um this is a fashion bug. It's an extra large. And it's a little Hawaiian, black and white, number 62, $5. Really cute blouse, like a Hawaiian style. I love my Hawaiians. Got a little pattern on the bottom, little um, Hawaiian flowers. This is number 62. And it buttons down the front, and it's got like a shawl collar almost like a shawl collar, so that's number 62. It's an extra large. The tag, the, um, that tag is ripped out. But I know it fits me, so it's, it's number 62. And then this is my other one. This is a vintage um, polyester 16W. It's a vintage shirt. Westbound is the brand. It's number 85. It's uh, 16W, it's polyester, and it's like a Hawaiian too. So look how cute it is. The roses on it, almost like a, a Hawaiian shirt, but it's got like um, a little bit of um, um, elastic at the bottom, like a, how do you call that? Gathering at the bottom. That's number 55. So that's $5. Those three. Right. Here's the one that I thought went with the um the blue the blue necklace. This is so cute now. I'm usually make for large, but this fits me. Look how cute this is. This is Zach and Rachel. It's a size large. It's number nine. Number nine, Zach and Rachel. And it's this watercolor, watercolor, and then it's got embroidery, bell sleeves, bow bow. So it's nice. It's so cute. Wear that with jeans with the legging, white pants. It's super cute. It goes with the um, that little necklace that I sold earlier. It kind of goes with that. This is a. Uh, um, Liz Claiborne Women, uh, 2X. It's a gray and white and black sweater. Um, three quarter sleeves. And it looks like this. And it's super cute. Too long, so come here, but this is number 68. And it's a uh, lightweight sweater for spring. Um, the material is, I just throw these in the washing machine. This one is rayon and poly. Turn the garment inside out, machine wash, cold with light colors. Done deal. So this one is an extra, extra large. It's a 2X. And it is a this clay one. And it's black. And, you know, I love my black. Black, gray, and white. And it's number 68. This one is an extra large. This one's Smith, number 11. It's $5. It's extra large. It's teal. It's 
heel t-shirt, long sleeve t-shirt with like the back wing. And it's got some beading on the front. And it's an extra large and it's teal. I just steamed it today. I steamed it. This fabric can be a little clingy, but um, I like it. Sometimes I'll wear like a sheep thing underneath it. So that's number 11. But I like the color. I like the color. That's pretty. All right. And this is um, Vintage. I don't know. This is it Covington. Yes, it is. It's from Sears. I don't know if they're still in business. Covington Women. This is a 16. 18W and it's still got the tags on it and it's a little animal print short sleeve jersey t-shirt number 57 number 57 five dollars um so cute short sleeve jersey brand new with tags cute with black pants right Number 57, animal print, short sleeve, really cute. Okay. It's not so cute. This one I almost kept for myself. But then I keep telling myself, if you keep something, you gotta get rid of two other things. So I was like, yeah, I'm not doing that. This is uh, One World XXL, number 18. But look at these cute colors. And I steamed this. It's like an ombre. And it's almost like a linen, but it's more. I uh, know um, some of these are from my house closet, which I'm not going to do house month anymore. So this is like an ombre. Is this adorable? I, I love this. This is number 18. Backwards. And it's one world. I know Heidi spells that word in. I just steamed this, guys. So just throw this in the washing machine, let it dry, then you get it with the steamer. Look how nice it looks. And it's super lightweight, like a lightweight linen, linen -y lightweight. 18 is the number on that one. I also almost kept, kept this one. I know it's only time for the pot. This is an XXL. It says it's a size 20. Um, Look at this boho shirt. Look how cute this is. It's got these little embroidered um, stars on it, and then it's got the boho sleeve. I'm making my boho rub off on you guys. And it's got the little peplum. And this one is going to be number 44. And it's so stinking cute. It's sheer, so you might have to wear something underneath it. But it is adorable, and I love these sleeves. I love these sleeves. So number 44, $5. And I'll, this is a dry one. So pretty. So pretty. Uh, this one, I don't know this brand. It's Missa. This is a little boho. I didn't, I didn't try this on, but I don't know. This is a little small. I think it's more like a boutique brand. It's called Camisa. Here's the tag. But it's a boho. Um, uh, it's a boho shirt. It's cotton. And then it's got all this. It's sort of like a, um, sort of looks like a Johnny Was. It's got all this embroidery on the front. It's cute embroidery. So I would say large or extra large. I, I don't know, it just looks like it might run a little small for me. It's number seven. But it's super cute boho. Number seven, it's cotton. I did steam it. I washed it and steamed it. Um, probably could use it again. Or it's just going to, it's that kind of fabric. Isn't that cute? It's that kind of fabric that sort of gets like like linen almost, like, like wrinkly. Look at the rickrack. No rickrack around the neck. Ever rickrack? <laughs> Number seven. Boho top. And 
Ashley Stewart, 526. This didn't sell on Posh. This was one of my favorite things, and it wasn't my size. It's a new shirt, it's a size 26, but it's a super cute denim shirt. Here, let me give it a number. Number 27. Okay, number 27. And look at this cute denim shirt. It's a size 26, it says. So it's got like the distressing, but then it's got all these cute little, cute little patches on here. So if you want to wear it over like a tank top, it's got all these cute little patches. You could roll up the sleeves. There's a patch on the on the on the arm. It's number 26. It's so cute. I love it. I tried it on today, but it was too, way too big on me. But I still like it. If you like oversized, number 27. Really cute. Just say 27. And then the only other thing I want, this one I have to get a little bit more money for. This is an anthropology. Um, this one you have to do ten dollars on. Everything else is five dollars. This is Wonderly, and this is um, anthropology brand. So I paid up for those. It's a two X. But it's so cute, it's, and it's brand new without tags. So this is Anthropology. Um, this one is ten dollars. It is going to be number number thirty-eight. If anybody likes Anthropology, um, here's a little peasant top. Here's the smocking. Got these beautiful flowers on it. Number thirty-eight. This one is ten dollars. Um, it doesn't sell. It's okay. I'll bring it to the stock. But it's really cute. And there's the sleeve. And it is new without tags. So I love it. Oh yeah, good for motorcycle. Yep. So I love this. I think this is so cute. I wish it was my size. I like these peasant tops. Okay, and that's it. Nobody wants that sweater. We already tried that. So nobody wants that wall sweater. It's a small. That's what I have. I'm gonna still keep going through my um, my unit, and um, I'm gonna definitely uh, bring you guys some more more shirts if you want me to, or I can pull pants or jeans or whatever. But I probably figured I would just sell those in the other sale. Pants are hard. Shirt, you kind of know what size you are. Love this. Yeah, all clean, ready to go. Put them on and then that's all. Okay. Let's go see what we got. Sit down now. <laughs> it's hard to smile, but I am going to do it. Good for motorcycle riding. That denim, oh yeah. All right, let me go back up to the top. Okay. Okay. Yeah, Karina, weren't those nice those candlesticks? I know you love your stretch on this too. Okay, Colleen's taking. Um, let's do clothes. Let's do. Let's do clothing. We only had one that was 10. Okay, so Pauline's getting 67. 67. Okay, uh, 51, 62. 62. 
you. Hey, Geneva. How are you, hon? Uh, Geneva's taking number nine. Geneva, send me an email because I think I have something else of yours here. If you don't mind sending me an email, so I know how to get in touch with you. So I'm pretty sure I have something else of yours here. She's taking number nine. Okay. If you don't mind sending me an email. Okay. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Tammy. Colleen's taking 68. Okay. Um, yeah, so, yeah, so I, right now I'm wearing like a large or an extra large, but most of these are from my past closet. 57 is the one of Swifty. This piece is getting 18. Okay. No, I never wore a two X. Renaissance number nine is the one. I love Boho too. In this case taken number twenty seven. Debbie wanted 27. Sherry wanted 27. Sorry, girls. And, and he's taken 38. 38. No. The other one. Okay, Renaissance. Um, number seven. you have something else here. Yeah, you might be lagging, hun. Yeah, 38's gone. Um, nine is gone. Um, seven is now gone. No, I'm not a small to a medium. No. Thank you, Geneva. Are you coming to Teak Stock? Oh, yeah, you're going to look great. Thank you for sending me the email. I have never been a small or a medium. Maybe when I was born. <laughs> Might have been when I was born. Okay, guys. Thanks for the clothing purchases. You helped me clear out my house and my house closet. And I appreciate that. Okay, what else do we have? I think that's it for today. I'll get invoicing done. Um have some leggings, but I think I'll save them for next week. I don't know. Does anybody want any leggings? We had a kids boutique. America had the kids boutique. I used to do women's clothing. And um, I, have, I found a whole box of them when I was at my booth yesterday that never got put out. But we used to sell these for $10. Um, I would get them from a California, the whole new mix. New mix. There's, there's a tag on it. We used to sell, sell out of them. People would just line up at the door whenever we got a, a shipment. They are um, one size and they are polyester. They are the softest leggings ever. I can sell them for $3. So I have, these are like a boutique print. I have. And I have more at the, if you guys like them, um, if you like them, I can get more from, um, I have a whole, another whole box and they're brand new with tags. So we used to do, um, we used to do mommy and me and the women would just come in with their kids and like the whole town would be like wearing mommy and me leggings. These are super soft. These are um, $3.00. And you can wear it with a solid color shirt. You can wear them around the house. You can sleep in them. They're one size. That's the pattern. 
to say batik. And I have, let's see, two pairs of batik, two batiks. This company, I love this company. They were so good to us. Um, I've got two pairs of batik. You know, put them on the house. Throw them on with a uh, chunky sweater or something. Boots. And then this is a one size, these are gray camo. Gray camo. So those are three dollars. Somebody likes the gray camo. I'll bring if, if I have any left, I will um I will bring some to Eek Stop because you will, these are like buttery soft. Remember the old Lula Rose? I don't even know if they're still in business. These were nicer. These are more soft. So I have one. Two, two, three, um, three pairs of the camo. Those cute black shirt. Or just you know, just to wear around the house instead of you know wearing you know just if you don't if you want to get dressed but you don't want to really get dressed dressed for the day. You just wear these. But you can wear them out on the street too. So I have two boutique and three camo. Anybody likes those? You do need need leggings. Debbie wants a um it's gonna be three dollars if you want the boutique. Let's make in one pair. All right. I, I will have some 2X, and she wants a gray camo. Okay. Um, um, I think I have some. Let me look. I'm going to pull what I have out of that box, because I have a huge death pile at the flea market. So, And that's stuff that's never been out. So I'm going to pull... Um, I have any um, plus size, as many as some, some two X. Okay. So I also have kids sizes, but I forgot to bring them home yesterday. But if anybody has um, a granddaughter that wears like a size large, I would just want to send them send them these. Look how cute these are with the little lemons on there, oranges, lemons, or if anybody knows a little girl that needs clothes. You live in PJs and gowns? Well, maybe you put some leggings on. <laughs> I would love to stay in my pajamas all day. Does anybody have, these are um, probably gonna fit like a nine or a 10 year old or an eight year old. You do Swifty? Okay, I'm gonna put these in your box. Aren't these cute? Aren't these cute with the little um, lemons on there? You can rehome those. I have more kids stuff too, I'll bring next week. But these are a large kids size. So I'll put those in your box. Freebies. Okay. Uh seven and ninety-nine from S. Yes, Renaissance. Aren't they adorable? They are so cute. I um yep, I'm gonna get you um okay. I'll get I'll I'll send the, you those for your granddaughter. Okay, so Renaissance, I'm gonna invoice you for both. And I'll put them both in the same package for you. Okay. And then I'm going to give Swifty the lemons of the granddaughter. And these are freebie. She'll like those. They're super cute. Okay, guys. I think I'm going to head out. I'll do some invoicing and some packing. I'll get everything packed up. And then don't forget, tomorrow is the um, crystal sale. If you want to check out Selena's goodies, here is the link to her short. Please go watch the short. And um, don't forget about the turtles. The baby turtles are coming. They're cute. They're all carved out of crystal. Have a great day, William. I hope we didn't bore you with the clothing. Um, 
And yeah, and um, if you guys, you know, if, if, if you need me for anything, you know how to get in touch with me. I'm on Facebook where you have my email address. And I hope you guys all have a wonderful day. Blessings to all of you. And we will talk soon. Yep, I am. I'm going to get blood work today. I'm getting blood work and an MRI on Monday. Thank you, Tammy. Thank you, thank you. Bye, guys. Love you.